This record, Simple Case of the Blues, has taken me about three years to complete. It started out with uh, Dave Rowe and Kenny Bond. We just got this crazy idea to make a blues record together in Nashville. We cut the tracks three years ago, and then I came home to Austin, Texas, Arlen Studios, and I got to finish this record here with Charlie Sexton. And now I've got this new CD. You know, I played and recorded country and rockabilly and blues, but never did I take my blues uh, as serious as I decided to take it on this record. Uh, it's basically, I went back to my roots. I started as the 16-year-old learning how to play the guitar with my high school buddy and my brother. The guys were just crazy about playing that lead guitar blues stuff, and they they got me into it, and they're like, hey, little sister, try this, you know, and then we would play rhythm guitar for each other and so we could practice our blues licks and everything. So, yeah, that's kind of how I started out. So this is kind of full circle. This record, of course, has my name on the cover, but there are so many great players on this. I wish I could just list them all on the cover so everybody would know. <laughs> Kenny Vaughn uh, and I played all the guitar parts together. T. Jared Bont on the piano. Um, you know, Robert Kraft sings. Uh, Mike Flanagan. I've always admired Charlie Sexton so much for his uh, music, musical abilities, his guitar playing, his, his singing, his writing. I just had a feeling that he would be the guy to uh, help me produce all the overdubs and help me get everything sounding the way it should. Some of the songs that I did on this record are, are covers. I picked some an original that Dave Rowe wrote. Uh, I wrote uh, I wrote a song with Kenny Vaughn that's uh, an instrumental. Mercy Felt Like Rain is a cover uh, from the, the young guy that I knew in high school that I used to play guitar with. His name is Paul Cowie. An odd choice of a song for a blues record would be Dwight Yoakam's If There Was A Way, but we treated it like very San Antonio horns. I can't wait for Dwight to hear it. I was just excited about taking this record out on the road. I love showing people that I can play guitar because a lot of people think that I'm just a singer. That It's great because people come up and say, I didn't know you were a guitar player. <laughs> this show is meant to uplift the audience. It's meant to make people happy, forget about your problems, just have a good time with Rosie and party on. I would have to say that Drive, Drive, Drive is one of my favorite songs too. Uh, perform live. It really gets the crowd going. Mm -hmm. 